curtain going down, floodlights up. Well, uh, guiding, it's, it was in the air and picked up magnificently. Aryan was, I think, uh, trying to place that one toward uh, third man. And Ethan D'Souza, the fielder. Well, a very good catch taken by the youngster. Aryan Lakala looks highly disappointed. Just guided it down to that point fielder's hands. It was outside off stump. He had the room, just the wrong shot selection there. You can see nodding his head in disbelief. He'll be very disappointed, Aryan. He's out for one, and uh, Emirates Blues nine for one. Yeah. Team Bold okay. on, making room for himself, on, Fahad Nawaz. Yet another disappointing end for Fahad. He was looking better but this time just couldn't get the line and the bounce correct played all over it was lot fuller not the ball to be cut and Fayaz Ahmed strikes he gets that man Fahad Nawaz has to walk back wicket number two down 17 of 17 66 for all the bowling all-rounders oh. <laughs> well he might be walking in because of the has taken a big wicket, Atik Rahman hit on the back leg. We'll have to see if that was missing the leg stump. But the umpire doesn't think so. He's given him out. Big wicket this for Abu Dhabi. I thought that was drifting, that was missing the leg stick. So, uh, 8 is what Atik Rahman could score. And uh, ECB 93 for some. Very good bowling by Adnan so far. Again, outside off stump. A big appeal and they've given him. The umpire has given him out. Alishan Sharfu. You need to get a big truck to pull him out. He looks very disappointed walking back slowly, the captain. But a big, big wicket this for Abu Dhabi. Look at that. Way outside the off stick. Had he left that one, would have probably been uh, just wide. And that's the reason why he's dejected Alishan Sharfu. 65, well made 65 and ECB 97 for 4. You can see what he's capable of. Oh, one shot too many. Muhammad Farazuddin, what have you done? Adnan has the last laugh. A big, big wicket this. Farazuddin was looking very good. 20 of 11 deliveries, but he's chopped it on. He looks livid with himself, but a big wicket for Abu Dhabi. That's what it happens. You got a six, then again attacking, trying to attack the bowler. And he paid the price. He's not happy. He'll have to go back in 20 and ECB 1, 2, 6 for 5. On the pads, big appeal, big appeal. But uh, yes, has been given a soft one at that. He's walking back. He's still not believing himself. He's waiting. He's just having a confirmation. That was really quick, Ijaz. Well, I think so that uh, he's uh, still there in the center. But uh, <laughs> I was saying it's off the bat. But Empire has given him his verdict for Rahul Bhatia. Seven down to 137. Cross seam bowling. Round the wicket. And clean bowled. What a great delivery. Aditya Shetty had no clue. By the time he realized where the ball is, the ball had already crashed into the stumps. Excellent bowling from Uzair. And uh, he has been a revelation in this Emirates D20. Yes, excellent bowling. Beautiful. Too late to reply. Lost the wicket. So there you go, Aditya Shetty. Run a ball. It's 8 down for 104. That looks like an edge. Yes, yes, he says. Zia is celebrating. And Nilanj Keswani has to walk back. Another wicket falls for Emirates Blues. They're losing their track in the death overs. And that has been a concern for Emirates Blues all throughout this tournament. Haven't been able to score runs. A thickish edge. And a very good catch by the keeper. So Nilanj Keswani is walking back, 5 of 7, 
148 for trying to get a yorker but he's just gone up into the sky wicket keeper he was just waiting but uh, fine leg comes under it and uh, took the catch so this is all it in 19.3 overs so three balls to spare in a team who were looking to score 160 plus not been able to play full court of their allotted overs yes clearly the momentum has shifted in the favor of Abu Dhabi they've taken wickets at uh, very important times in the game this time Sahil Haryani takes a very good catch at that fine leg region not easy those catches and uh, that will bring the end to an innings of uh, Emirates Blues they could have got uh, a lot more but I think credit has to be given well it's a risky shot against Nilanch and there you have it He's got in the wicket. The celebration comes out. You cannot play Nilanj Keswani for spin. You have to play him as a left-handed in-swing bowler. And Ghulam Farid has done all the hard work, but he's given his wicket away. 22 of 20 deliveries. ECB finally has a breakthrough. It's important breakthrough. They were looking for that wicket desperately. Six overs and no wickets. So right now it is uh, Nilanj Keswani who's given them that breakthrough that they wanted. Ghulam Farid is walking back. 22 of 20. 44 for 1 is the factor involvement uh, at this stage. Down the wicket. This has gone high. Like a Burj Khalifa up into the sky, into the hands. So the wicket there. Second on 85 and that was required. Look at that. It was a googly. Couldn't really connect the ball well. Got the height, not the distance. An excellent reverse cup catch in the deep. Atar Rahman is out for 37. And Abu Dhabi 85 for 2.